In this video, I'm going to talk about Microsoft Copilot Pro versus ChatGPT Plus and which is better. So in this video, I'm going to present some of the key features between both of these so you can help and choose whatever one is best for your specific use case. So Microsoft Copilot Pro and ChatGPT Plus are both advanced versions of their base AI tools, offering more features and capabilities. So for the focus and the strengths of each. Microsoft Copilot Pro is going to lean towards coders. It excels at code completion and suggestion, improving productivity for developers. It offers retrieval augmented generation to craft chatbots for specific tasks according to the context of what you are doing. It will offer Microsoft integration so it seamlessly integrates itself into Microsoft applications and development environments and it put potentially offers stronger data security due to Microsoft's focus on enterprise solutions, although both companies will have great security with their tools. For ChatGPT+, it is open-ended creativity. It shines in creative text generation like poems, scripts, musical pieces, emails, and code, although code generation might require more user guidance. And like I said, it isn't as good as the focus of Microsoft Copilot Pro in gathering contacts around your code. However, ChatGPT Plus also offers wider third-party integration, connecting to a broader range of applications and services through OpenAI API, and it put potential lower cost, meaning that ChatGPT Plus might have a slight cost advantage depending on the current status of the Copilot Pro subscription cost. So. These are going to be all of the strengths and focuses of these two services. For the weaknesses, Microsoft Copilot Pro has limited creative focus. While we can generate creative text formats, it may not be as strong in free-form creative writing compared to ChatGPT+, and it requires a Microsoft 365 subscription for access, although I believe you already expect that. For ChatGPT+, it has a weaker code focus, so co code generation might require more user input and it may not be as accurate. And it has a potential for bias because large language models can inherit biases from the data they are trained on, so be mindful when using ChatGPT+, for sensitive tasks. So to summarize, here's a breakdown again. You should choose Microsoft Copilot Pro if your priority is getting code completion done and developing task-specific chatbots, and you work within the Microsoft ecosystem. You value tight integration with Office applications, and data security is a top concern. You should choose ChatGPT Plus if your focus is on creating creative text generation and open-ended exploration of ideas. And if you need an AI tool that integrates with a wider range of applications beyond Microsoft products, and at the end of the day, if cost is a deciding factor. So ultimately, the best choice depending on your specific needs and workflow. Consider trying out both in the trial version, and you will usually choose Copilot if you do strictly coding or ChatGPT Plus if you are more open-minded and creative in your tasks. I hope I was able to help you on choose between Copilot Plus and ChatGPT Plus. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.